Hey guys, this is Swordfish, and today I'm playing Rogue Legacy. I, uh... I need to... I don't have enough money for anything right now. But I need to change my runes around. Or... Uh, right, I'm in... I'm in farming mode, as it were. Uh, as far as, like, gathering how much equipment, gathering gold and equipment. So I have my farming runes on the higher difficulty and more gold per enemy thing, sort of. I need to really, so I'm, I'm training, basically, for the Maya. Because that's my next, my next adventure is in the Maya. And I haven't really, I've been so afraid of it because it's, it's scary and the monsters are hard. I haven't really, um, figured out what, oh boy, exactly what I need from the Maya yet, like, or what, what I'm gonna need to be able to take on those enemies, Ob other than just generally being more awesome, which is always a goal. You should always, for anything, not just, not just Rogue Legacy or video games, your goal should always be to be more awesome. And, uh, so I need my character to be more awesome. But... I'm not sure what kind of awesome, specifically what kind of awesome I need. I know that when I was fighting the uh, Alexander, the the boss in the in the forest, I needed to be able to um, to deal more damage rather than take more damage because I I. I knew I'd be able to avoid him long enough, but I needed to be able to kill him faster so that I didn't have to. What? I don't have my dash rune. And I don't have the P-E, whatever it's called, the foot, the foot thing. P-A-D. I got P-E-Ds on the brain. I'm a baseball fan. Oh, this actually works. I'm a, I'm a baseball fan, so... If anyone's been paying attention to baseball news, there's this whole huge uh, scandal right now with players being suspended for PEDs, performance enhancing drugs. So I've got that uh, that acronym on the brain. Not acronym. An acronym is supposed to be pronounceable. That's one of those, uh, well, actually, things that you should never tell anyone in polite company. But it is true. Alright, can I... I can't, I can't get to him, that's a shame. Um, nobody likes a well actually, that's a person who uh, corrects you when, you know, when you say, oh, that's a, PEDs is an acronym, and they go, well actually, an acronym is a word that should be pronounced like scuba. Just, uh, I mean, yeah, that's true, but uh, just don't, don't be that guy. You should really, I firmly believe that you should make an effort in life never to be that guy. It doesn't matter what kind of guy that guy is referring to, but if anyone could ever call you that guy, you probably did something wrong or are annoying and should, should stop doing that thing that they're calling you that guy for. Just, when did I lose all my mana? Do I not have any mana as this guy? Oh boy. Oh, this is a scary room. But I really would like this chest. I really would like this fairy chest. I really need some more runes. Alright, well that was... I assume there's more over here. But they're not chasing me, so that's... Oh. Oh. Oh, jeez. Got him. Well, that, that used most of my health worth it grace rune that is one I don't have yet that's exciting 
Oh, I know this. Yeah, there's a chest there. That one's actually not that hard. It looks scary, but it's not that hard. Let me just see what's up here first. The Maya. And is there a chest in this room? Nope. Oh, it's a GTFO. Um. So yeah, in life, you should never be that guy. Another big, another well actually is, um, the, don't drink the Kool-Aid. If actually, if you want to be accurate, the thing that, what, hang on. Something weird just happened. Did I stop recording? Am I st I'm still recording. Am I still... I'm still recording. Um, okay. We're all good, I think. That was weird. I just pressed some buttons and, uh, minimized the screen. Maybe it was some kind of weird key combo that did... Oh, it's the select button. Oh, shit. The game crashed. All right, well, that was weird. The, um... Let me just press select a couple more times. The game crashed. That's never happened before. It's a little disconcerting. We're not gonna worry about it too much. Just keep going with our run. I don't... I totally lost my train of thought. Not like I'm good at... Maintaining trains of thought in the first place, but oh, it's the carnival. This is fun. I like this game. All right, let's do it. Ten daggers to destroy four targets. This is new, actually. Yeah, I want to give it a try. Oh, interesting. Okay. Okay. I can do this. Oh. No, I can't. No, I can't. No, I can't. I can't do this. Oh, man. I really lost my focus. This is really fun. Well. I got some gold. <laughs> Shut up, clown. That was not nice. Um, I was saying something about annoying people, being that guy, whatever. Never mind. Ah. So I really need to level up before I take on the, um, before I, I take on the Maya. But I realized, and this is something I didn't know until I was watching, I've, I'm a um, big fan of a little, little LP channel, his name is Jibtuck, he does a lot of, um, he's been doing Rogue Legacy and The Binding of Isaac, both of which are very entertaining series and I highly recommend them. Um, but I learned that... I mean, I guess I realized this, but I never really thought about it. The enemies in this game scale up with you as you as you level up. They get they get more difficult. So I don't want to spend too much time grinding levels because I'm gonna end up with uh, the enemies are just gonna get harder. It's not really gonna be useful. But. I still need to be stronger. I re although I do think it actually is more about equipment. Well, at, at certain at a certain point, it becomes more about equipment and less about actual level ups. All right, these guys are now. I thought that I'd be safe here. I remember doing this once and being safe all the way in the corner. I wonder if that's still the case. It is, so far. This isn't a mini-boss, but... Ah, oh, crap. I got too fancy. 
It's not a mini boss, but this is worth my time, I think. They do give me a bunch of gold. And if they're gonna be harder. <clears throat> sorry. If they're gonna be harder because of my rune thing, it might be extra worth it. Ah! Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Ah! Oh, I'm. Got any close here. There we go. Oh, I almost just. Oh boy. Oh, diamond. Oh, that's nice. Is that a nice diamond? Okay. We got a lot of money. That's good. We need money. We need money. I assume the forest is going to be this way. Soon, at least. Oh no. Oh, I'm so low. Whew. I would really like to level up my my vampire. If I could get some more vampirism runes, that'd be awesome. Because those are... Now, another thing I learned, so I was watching my friend, uh, old Jibtuck. He had... He, he had enough vampirism that he's getting eight health every kill, and it looked, it just looked so nice, and I want that. I was jealous. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. I'm dying. Oh. Oh. Well, that was a good haul. Good haul of enemies. I got a lot of gold there. See what's next. Spelunker. He's got the gold thing. Chickens freak him out. There are no chickens in this game, as far as I know. Oh, this guy. I love this guy. Hokage. Do you remember things with extreme clarity? I, I don't know what that's been. What that would affect, really. And ah oh, man, I really should have checked in my last go round. Gold gain up sounds awesome but it's an extra 10% it would give me 13 gold instead of 12 gold I don't know how much of a difference that would make I think it might be more useful to just do more damage attack up or maybe carry carry up armor up health up I don't know what to do anymore magic damage this is the only thing I don't have, so I'm gonna get that just to get those little windows on the castle. Invulnerability time. Mana cost. I can't afford that anymore anyway. This doesn't seem worth it now. It's a huge waste. Carry. Did I get any? I didn't get any armor, I got a rune. Which I need to save money for, or at least... Because they're getting more expensive. I feel like I should do these two just to grow the top. Bestiality. Half man, half... Six letter swear word. And it's... Only one upgrade, that's interesting. Um, how do I get to... I want to get to this one. Does that grow anything? It does. Randomized children. Oh, that's awesome. Make a whole new batch of babies. That's really cool. Alright. Did I need any more carrying capacity? No, I'm good... on my equipment so far. And I have one more. I just got a rune. What was it? Grace rune. Enemies scale slower, easier, but lesser rewards. Oh, I don't really... I don't really want that. Another thing I learned from watching uh, Tuck was that triple jump is even more awesome than double jump, so it would be nice if I could save some money. Uh, so they're 12-something? I would need to save 12... Uh, 13 to be safe, because I, I forgot already to get that um, upgrade, the 
Oh wow, I'm so fast. Oh my god. To get the, um, that rune to get triple jump. Yay, this is fun. I'm gonna just do this as, as pogo practice. Oh man. Pogo all the way down. Here. Wow, this is hard. And the whole world shakes when you stand on a barrel. Are the barrels wiggly? The barrels aren't wiggly, that's weird. Okay. Oh, oh! So the... He has the ability... What, what is it called? I didn't see it. X... Edmem. You remember... Edmem? Idmem? You remember enemy placement, so that's the minimap enemy thing. That's what that, that's what that skill does. Oh, and if you leave and come back, um, it leaves them on the. They're on the minimap. That's useful, I suppose. Okay. God, I love this, this Hokage. He's so fast and does so much damage. What is my skill exactly? It looks like a, a puppy sitting... It looks like a, a sad puppy sitting on the ground. That's what that looks like, my magic spell. I assume it's not a sad puppy. I hope it's not a sad puppy. Because that would be... I hate sad puppies. Puppies are supposed to be happy. That's what... That's why puppies are awesome. Is because they're always happy. I saw the cutest video today online. This is... This is a weird... This this video has gone to a weird place now. At work, we, uh... Okay. I gotta... I gotta prepare myself for that. At work, we, um... We send each other a lot of cute videos, and the cute video I saw today was a corgi. I love corgis because they're amazing. They're like little cartoon dogs. A corgi who was playing with his toy on the staircase, and he dropped it. Whoa! Whoa! He was playing with his toy on the staircase, and he dropped it, and then he like flopped his head down in defeat, the poor little guy. It was so cute and so sad, and I'm gonna have to link to it or put it in the uh, description or make a haste rune. That's, that could be could be useful. Have to put it an annotation or, or something, because it'd be really sad. I'd be really sorry if I. It'd be really mean of me to tell you about it and, and not show you. That could be a a good feature for my channel. Cute video of the day. It, like, just as, just in the comments or in the description of each video. That's a, um, sounds like a cheap but effective way to gain viewership. Swordfish the, the cute gamer. Well, not me. I'm not the cute gamer. My girlfriend thinks I'm cute. But, that doesn't count. This video has gone to a weird place. Like I said a minute ago, and I started talking about the corgi. Is there anything in this room for me to even get? Well, that was good, actually. The chicken. I really want this gold. I want this gold, too. I can't kill... I can't kill these things, can I? This big spiky balls of death. I don't think I can kill them. And I don't want to... Okay, I, I'm done down here. I don't want to go in that left... The bottom left room. It, it's just too scary. Those things are really hard to jump across. I'm, I'm not exactly a master of jumping in this game. I want to go... Oh, it's a journal. 
Time for some dramatic reading, right, guys? Journal entry number 12. I have found a solution to my hunger problem. The forest holds an endless bounty of delicious mushrooms, and within these mushrooms lie chicken legs. Also, gold coins and vials of sparkling water. I broke open a tree trunk earlier, and a bag of money fell out. Sometimes I feel like I've gone insane. <laughs> Plus, what is up with the moon? It's huge! Oh my god, is that part of the moon outside? That is huge. I love when games poke fun at game tropes, like... Like that, like I... Like, a bag of money fell out of this tree, or whatever he said. Like, that's really... Really dumb. That's, yeah, those, because in that, in the forest, the, like, breakables are tree stumps and stuff. It's like, I broke this tree stump and a bag of money or a chicken leg fell out. In hindsight, I was saying earlier in this episode when I was choosing my hero what the, uh, fear of chicken could do. Maybe you don't heal as much could, from the chicken legs? Could that be it? Oh my god, homing missiles. Oh my god. If you don't heal as much from the chicken, that'd be really unfortunate. I have to find out what the sad puppy does. Oh, right. It, um... Let me just go to the teleporter. It makes a, like, shadow copy of you, and then, like, recalls you there when you want, so, like, Hey, fighting! Nope, not fighting anymore. That, um... Oh, did I not go in the teleporter? Oh, no, that's not a teleporter room. That's a... That's the journal. Silly me. Silly me. I suppose I could see where that teleporting thing could... Oh, no! Could have been useful. That was bad. Um... I don't know. Take no damage. Well, if I take any damage, I'm gonna die. I'm almost... Let's see what's in this room. I'm almost dead anyway. Let's see what's in this room, too. Nothing. Oh, boy. Um... I'm almost dead anyway. I think it's probably worth a shot. Oh, boy. I jumped a little too late. A little too late. How much money did I make that episode? That, that, uh, and that, anyway. Oh my god, an ADHD hookage? Break stuff to restore mana. And freezing all enemies. This guy could be, this could be a solid, solid run. I'm gonna save this money because I wanted to buy, oh, I got another rune also. I got a haste rune. Increase your move speed. I think... Oh, the vampire rune is so nice to have. I was gonna... I was gonna buy this vault rune to have triple jump. Um, but the vampire rune is really... Tough to let go. I'm not sure. Sprint, and this is run, and this is... Slaying enemies grants hit point and magic points. That actually sounds really useful. If it... We'll see. It, it probably stacks with the vampirism, because it's the same... Uh, it's got the same icon, but also mana, so that could be really good. We're gonna we're gonna give it a shot. I've gotten used to playing without sprinting. That's nice. Cause I was using the sprint rune everywhere. Oh my god, I'm so fast. I'm so fast. Well, this should be a good run. We gotta we gotta be um, be careful here. Oh my god. Well, that is, that is the law, isn't it? When you say, be careful, you get hurt immediately. Okay, three hit points. I gain three hit points when I kill an enemy. That's, whoa! I've never seen those before, the angled ones. Ah. 
Now this actually would be really useful for my for that that shadow thing that I, I had the spell, the sad puppy spell. That would be really useful because you could sad puppy at the beginning of the room and then um, recall yourself back to the to the entrance after you did the obstacle. You wouldn't have to go through the obstacle twice. That's really that's really cool. Boy, I wish I had more health. I th I guess the damage is worth it. This this Hokage is my favorite guy because of the damage. One hit killing every enemy is just for the beginning at least is pretty awesome. Time stop uses uses 14. Oh, it used all of my mana. It says it uses 14, but it used all of it. Do I have a breaks up to restore a magic point? Low. I don't know why that happened. That happened last time too. Last. Um, last hero, I used the spell once, and it drained all my mana. I don't know. That's confusing. Am I doing something wrong? I'm not really sure what's up with that. Okay. I want to get out of there. Well, are there any enemies? Are there any enemies here in this room? Just check for chests. At least while we're being... No chests, okay. Oh jeez, and this is like a pit of spikes. This is really... I'm not looking forward to, to that. Um, I don't know if I'm doing something wrong with the, um, the magic or what, because it's using like all of my mana every time I cast a spell. Maybe it drains and I'm supposed to turn it off? I turn it on and I'm supposed to turn it off? I don't know. All right, we got a journal. Journal entry number 13. I slew the beasts of the forest. I did that recently. And I felt the throne room weaken once Felt the throne room weaken once more. So far, my assumptions have proven correct. Each wing of the castle has its own guardian beast. Was this designed as a test of will? If so, then I cannot fail. For the further I venture, the more bold I become. Tonight I scour the tower. I'm on a roll. Um, I need to scour the tower soon. I want to clear out the castle. But my goal is to safely, safely, clear out the castle and then go explore the Maya a little bit. But that's the tower. That probably leads to the forest. Explore the Maya a little bit. And like I said before, see what I need. Exactly. See exactly what I need as far as upgrades. Not that, I mean, I need everything, really. Really what I need is a, is a swordfish upgrade. I need to be better at this game. But, uh, you can't buy that in the store, unfortunately. Just, oh man, doing that much damage is just so awesome. And being this fast, like I just waltzed right in there, smacked that guy once from under the floor, got the chest and got out, like no problem. It's so awesome. This is perilous. Oh my god. Perilous, so perilous it may not be worth it. Well, worth it. Worth it. Okay. Although, not worth it, because I could have got there without it. Without. Without that, uh. Without going the complicated way, but it's okay. There we go. 
try to avoid jumping because I know I'll jump right into the spikes. I am flying through this room. This is so nice. Come on, hot. Yeah. Alright, next time I get into a tough room, I'm going to use the time stop spell. Well, this is perfect. It does, it drains. It drains. Well, that was perfect. That was the perfect, perfect opportunity to use it. Vault Rune Cape, nice. I don't remember what I have on my cape. I think it's the gold up, which is great because um, once I'm done like trying to actively get gold here, I can use the cape to put the vault rune on to get my triple jump. That would be super nice. This, um... This probably goes to the Maya, yeah. This, uh... Combo of time stop and mana regen on breaking stuff is really nice. Because anytime there's a really hard room, or like a defeat all enemies room in that case, I can just stop time, do it, and then I kind of passively regain all my mana. That's really, really cool. I like it. Did I finish the castle? Yes, that's all the castle rooms. So do I want to go to the forest and try to get more money? Or do I want to go to the Maya and see what's up? I think I want to go to the Maya. I think, I think that's what I want to do. Let's go to the Maya. I want to figure out what is it, what it is that I need. What, um, what's not good enough. What I need to improve, if it's damage or whatever. Oh, I have an itch. Oh my god. Oh, oh. Oh, yeah. Itches are so distracting. Oh, that was a bad one. Okay. Oh, Mimic. I forgot about the Mimics. Alright, if you kill a Mimic, does it, like... It does. It just killed itself? That's bizarre. There's two chests in this room. and spikes on the ceiling. Everything is just more dangerous. That's the first thing I notice. Ranger Helm. I think that's the mana up one. Not as useful. What are you, buddy? Can I... Well... I probably could have done my little drop on his head. There we go. Ah! Nope, not worth it. There are just, like... There's just spikes everywhere. It's just so much more dangerous. The monsters are tough, too. The monsters are tough. That's a mimic. Now, I can tell it's a mimic. One, because I guess, because it's wiggling. It's wiggling. Um, but also because... Oh, boy. Because it wasn't... Uh, it wasn't showing up on the map. Alright, well... I don't... Okay, so now that was instructive. I, I see Darth Maul. I don't remember killing Darth Maul. He's in the second row in the middle next to the Mimic between the Red Eyeball and the Mimic. That's totally Darth Maul. Kind of. Um, so that was actually instructive, the Maya. There's just dangerous crap everywhere. There's spikes and, and spike traps and besides the enemies. So... I'm going to need more health. The hokage, I guess that's how you say it, is great because it does so much damage so fast, but his hit points are so low. It's really tough to survive in there. That's uh, that's the last run for this episode. I got a lot of money, which is nice. Going to buy some stuff soon. So, guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like down below the video. If they ever move it, that's going to look really foolish. Wasn't the like on the side before? I remember seeing so many YouTube videos of people pointing to the left. Now everybody points down. 
just give it a like wherever the like button is when you're watching this. I'd really appreciate it. If you want to see more videos, subscribe to my channel. They'll come up in your feed. If this game looks fun to you, I strongly encourage you to support Cellar Door Games. Give it a buy. Indie developers are awesome. We need more of them, and we need them to be happy and successful. Everyone should be happy and successful. Really, that would be nice. So do your part. Yeah. That's all for today. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.